So uh, <laughs> you'll be glad to know this is also about um, getting credit for software. And so uh, and it builds upon prior work. Um, so we're going to be using content line tools very much during this as well to help you get uh, a lot of things like that. Um, basically, I've noticed that uh, a lot of journals, particularly the so called pop journals, actually shut away all the valuable technical information in these huge files or the software that's material. And actually, a lot of the time, there's um, hidden software citations in there. So I've got Citations. That's, that's what the project is really about. We're going to be coal mining for hidden citations in this quagmire of sort of rich materials. Um, and it, it's, it's really sad how kind of, there's all these references hiding out in sort of rich materials and they don't get indexed. So people like when they get a notification, you know, that their software or their work has been cited in Google Scholar or in Web of Science or in Scribblers. But all three of those indexing services actually only um, look at text of the paper, they don't actually look at supplementary materials. So anytime anything is cited in supplementary materials, it basically doesn't get counted. And um, I'd like to you know, go back and change that and actually look at um, retrospective um, citation counting for the software and um, see what we find. I've already found some examples of that really finding out the scale of the problem and actually addressing it. And maybe making the leaderboard the worst journal or something. <laughs> Um, so we 